When they won that Super Bowl that year, there was no one better. I remember that story Madden told about their, their last real practice. He was just so sharp that he just called it off. He's, you know, they were, he, John Madden's talking about, we were halfway through practice and everything is rolling so good and Snake is so sharp. He just said, you know, let's, let's go. Let's, it's over. It's time. It's time. And that's how they played in that game. You know, like that was against the Vikings, wasn't it? I mean, yeah, he just cut him. Up. But, but Snake was a when, when he had to when he when he was right when he was healthy and good he he was he he was magic. He could he could slice you apart. He and he he was tough, tough guy. You know he he didn't fear anything. He intercept. You know if there's any, ever been a quarterback that you know we we tell these kids that you know overcome adversity. If there's ever been a quarterback that. That an interception didn't bother. It was Snake. He it didn't bother him. It, hey, it's gonna happen. But I'm fixing to get a touchdown now. He, 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 he was really, really a great player. Yeah, I think he should be. He was, he was sure good. I don't know how you, you know, I. The only thing I know about the Hall of Fame, I've never seen anybody in there that shouldn't be in there. So that that group does a good job. But they need to take a good look at, at Snake. I don't know what always the criteria is, but you know, in in my book, he was a Hall of Fame quarterback. What do you remember about that game in '79? Same. He picked us apart. It's just like I was saying about somebody coming back. We're beating them like we're 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 beating them like a drum, and we're we're a bad team. You know, we're a bad team beating a good team, tearing them up. And uh, I remember they. They, they, they were going to take him out. They just picked up Jim Plunkett. They sent Plunkett in for him. He sent Plunkett back out. I counted my mind right then. I went, uh-oh, you know, because, <laughs> you know, yeah, like I said, a bad half, a bad quarter, three, four interceptions, didn't bother him. Didn't bother him. He could, he could play. Thanks, buddy.